Okay, Charles LeBlanc here. We're in the ball field. We're Saturday. Saturday afternoon, there was a pursuit from the Fredericton Police Force with a drunk driver. Anyway, the drunk driver was first spotted at Subway about half a mile down there, and they give pursuit. On a Saturday where it's busy, uh, there's a lot of traffic, a lot of families doing the family business. Now what happened, they give pursuit, and uh, they, uh, there was a rollover, the SUV rollover in this area, look. You can look around and look at this. It shows you how, oh, maybe the guys was this brand new, $24, size 12 kid. Huh, hey, get a close up. Come on closer. So anyway, so there could have been a kid involved, who knows. But what I'm saying is this, down the States, it happens all, all the time. They got, they have pursuit, and once they get, they have pursuit that some people, innocent bystanders are getting killed. How come the police just didn't follow the drunk driver until he stopped somewhere in a red light and have him surrounded and stop him and just make sure he made it home, then talk to him? Why are they so gun ho like, like kids with a toy with siren, woo, 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 here we go. Look, 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 it's a disaster. It all happened, there's glasses all over the place, and look. So, bottom line, the cops, they gotta stop taking steroids. It's affecting their way of thinking. We had the most racist police force in Canada, and now you got something like this, they don't have to be gun ho and just, hey public, look at us. This is not a game. People's life are that say, come on cops, excuse my language, smart the fuck up.